Hi, so in this video I'll be showing you how to use the rain drop detection sensor on an Arduino. These modules are pretty cheap, you can usually get them for about $1.77 US. This is one of the sensors here. You'll see that it comes in two parts. There's the actual raindrop sensor, and then there's the control board that it's connected to, which will transfer the data to the Arduino. This is probably going to be the easiest sensor you've ever put together. You just need to use the attached ribbon cable to plug the sensor to the board, and then using three more cables, plug from the VCC and ground ports on the board to the 5 volt and the ground port on the Arduino, and from the A0 port on the board into the analog output or A0 on the Arduino. So this sensor won't be needing any library or anything. We're just going to be writing a few lines of code to get the data from the analog port. So start off by typing serial.begin with 9600 in brackets there. In the setup method, that's just setting up the bitrate connection to the Arduino. And in the loop method for this program, just write int sensor reading equals analog read with A0 in brackets. That's just receiving an integer value from the A0 port. Then you just need a print statement printing the integer value we got from the sensor to the serial monitor so we can view it and also add in a 150 millisecond delay there. So now to get this program working, just upload it to your Arduino. Of course, making sure that the right COM board is selected for your board. Open up the serial monitor and you should start seeing values appearing there once it's uploaded properly. So the analog pin is measuring the voltage output from the sensor. So you'll see when I pour water on the sensor, the output value goes to under 400 compared to the 1022, 1023 value it was outputting before. And now if I wipe all the water off the sensor, the values will go back up to what they were before. So using this, we can tell how wet the sensor is. We'll now add a bit more code to the program so it'll only print when there's water on the sensor. And this will allow you to put your own code in, which will only be run when the sensor gets wet. So we're putting in an if statement just after the integer declaration and assignment. And so inside this if statement, you can put your own code to be run when the sensor gets wet. But in this case, we'll just be putting a print line statement saying that it's raining. Just comment out your other print line statement and upload this to your Arduino. So same as last time, just open up your serial monitor and pour some water onto your sensor. Now you should see that it'll only start printing out to the serial monitor once it's got enough water on the sensor. So again, just wipe the water off your sensor and you should see that it stops printing to the serial monitor. Like I said before, if you've got code you're wanting to implement, you can just replace the print line statement here with your own code. Thanks for watching this really short tutorial. If this helps you out at all, please leave a like below and subscribe for more videos. Thanks.